Actress Atiya Shetty tied the knot with cricketer KL Rahul earlier this week at her father Sunil Shetty's farmhouse in Khandala. A select group of friends which included the Boos who were Bollywood and Indian cricket attended the intimate ceremony, with photos later making a wave on social media. Among the many wedding-related discussions currently happening online, much has also been said about the gifts received by the newlyweds. According to reports, the duo received several luxurious presents from their friends and family, including an apartment in Mumbai, luxury vehicles and jewelry. The father of the bride reportedly gifted the couple a flat worth 50 crore rupees, while his close friend Salman Khan gifted Atiya a luxury Audi car worth 1.64 crore rupees. Actor Jackie Shroff gifted the bride a 30 lakh rupees Shopa watch, while Arjun Kapoor bought her a diamond bracelet for 1.5 crore rupees. Cricketers Virat Kohli and MS Dhoni also opted for expensive gifts, reportedly gifting Rahul a BMW car worth 2.17 crore rupees and a Kawasaki Ninja bike worth 80 lakh rupees respectively. While gifts in India are taxable if their aggregate value during the year exceed 50,000 rupees as income from other sources, this does not apply to weddings. Income tax authorities have provided an exemption for those receiving gifts at weddings, albeit with a few conditions. Any gifts a newlywed couple receive from their immediate family as well as friends are exempted from taxation. The exemption does not extend to monetary gifts received on occasions like birthday, anniversary, etc. Marriage of the individual is the only occasion when monetary gift received by him will not be charged to tax. Apart from marriage there is no other occasion when monetary gift received by an individual is not charged to tax, a tutorial on the income tax website clarifies. In the context of KL Rahul and Atiya Shetty's wedding, it would mean that the gifts they received from family and friends for their wedding are not taxable. Topics Income Tax